Hi, this is Rick DeWitt with Axiom going over translation secret number seven. And what we're going to cover today are the filter options that exist when translating between MicroStation and AutoCAD. These options, these filter options are available going in either direction. And uh, I've got an AutoCAD file open on the screen here. And we're going to go to File, Save As. And in the Save As dialog box, again, we're going to go to VADGN Files. And clicking the Option button, you'll notice that one of the tabs here is called Filter and clicking that you have some choices that you can make to control the information from the AutoCAD or MicroStation file that's going into the other format and at the top you have one called geometry and you can limit the geometry based on a fence or a selection set if you have a fence or selection set active at the time you initiate this save as. In addition you have a models button and in the models button if you have more than one model in the file you can choose one or more by clicking it holding the control or shift key down and clicking the models that would apply so if everything for example was in model space and you didn't want the layouts you would just leave them out and hit OK uh, next you have a series of check boxes and the check boxes are used to control the information that's going to ultimately wind up in the other file for example save views in microstation do you want to save them when you save it into microstation the shared cells check box shared cells are comparable to blocks so so in MicroStation you have shared cells and normal cells. Blocks are very similar to shared cells. If you turn off the shared cells checkbox, then when you save these blocks into MicroStation they'll become normal cells. I should warn you however that if the blocks have attributes you're going to lose the attributes unless you also turn off tags which are similar to block attributes in which case the tags or the block attributes will become text during the translation you can also turn on or off frozen levels to control whether elements or geometry on frozen levels is translated and you'll notice here an unshared un use shared cell definitions checkbox and what this is all about if you have blocks defined in the AutoCAD file or shared cells in the MicroStation file when you save to the other format if you turn this off then the unused blocks or shared cell definitions found in the file will not be translated hope this helps you in your next translation